the Bully and the Beast Podcast. Yo, yo, yo. Yeah. Bully and the Beast Podcast. That's us, that's us. We back. I feel so good to be back in the studio yeah. and like... Not in your face because I hate mm. your face, but yeah, like just way. the energy of the room. I you think know? that's a little better. I ain't gonna lie to you. I mean, much as I don't like you, and I kind of like, no, oh, she's not here today. Great, you know. Not, that's you know, never how you feel. You. Yeah, ever. but now that you are here, I understand what it is just to have you here, and I do feel a little bit better. You than tried you to give me a hug, and I had to karate chop your ass. Yeah, it went out. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, nice. what's been going on um, with you? Just chilling, man. Just, you know, out here trying to make a dollar out of 15 cents, right? No? Okay, Pop. It's 50 cents out of a dollar. Oh, God, you had to fuck it up. <laughs> it is 15 cents out of... If you got 15 cents, you would make that a dollar. Ain't no trying to make a dollar out of 15 cents. That's retarded, right? Okay. All right, thank you. That's the words, though. Yeah, I get it. Okay, but... but um, um, yeah, go ahead. You know, I do... I, I, You know, our favorite... Well, one of my favorite parts. I don't know what the fuck you like. What? But one of my favorite parts is the voicemails. Of course. Because I feel like, at first I didn't like it because I'm like, we're not, it's not Engaging elaborate mm-hmm. enough. No, I wanted more details. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? But now I love it because y'all motherfuckers be rambling on these fucking <laughs> who's on drug calls. And some of them, some yeah. of y'all motherfuckers be fucking up the show with yeah. your bullshit. Yeah. Now get straight to the point. Period. Jumping and, and, and talking all that good stuff. But don't be making up shit as you go along or yeah. wax weird friends calling with some fucking weird stories. Not we don't want to hear that shit. We get it, but you know. Erica, please come back. No, we don't want we don't like you. Maybe. No, I just really want to know what happened to her. Did you know. kill her? No, no, of course not. I didn't, of course I didn't kill her. I mean I think it was just some fraud that was just out here just trying to I don't think so, because you was you had beads of sweat. You either paid that bitch off. <laughs> I don't know what you did. You pay her rent. Or... I'm in a relationship. So like I said. Who the fuck you think you're talking to like that? Are you on drugs? Oh yeah. You just try to have some bass in your voice. <laughs> Oh, I see what's going on. All right, so we just going to get straight into the voicemails today, yes. on today. Amen. And first, we want to say thank y'all for listening. Yes, man. Uh, supporting it. and downloading and putting y'all friends on because yes. everybody comes up to me in the street and be like, oh, my God, yes. I hate wax. Same That's how I do. Like, y'all like the way she be talking to you, yo. No, people <laughs> tell me they love it. I mean, I get, I get that too. Yeah, the, the, the dude be like, "Yo, bro, I feel for you." The girl from like, he deserve it. I'm yeah, like, they do. I'm like, I want to say fuck you, but your boyfriend right here, I'm mean, gonna have to beat him up. But all right, yes, ma'am, peace. All right, so if you have any advice you need, mm-hmm. like um, wax, he always needs advice. I really do right now. Right. Um, yes. If you have any questions, any mm-hmm. comments, motherfucking call in. If you, uh, some, I heard somebody wrote a song for me. I would love to hear this. I don't know. By the way. I heard it's terrible. That's what T. Diddy said. That's so even better. Y'all need to go on her DMs. Smith said it was terrible, too. Perfect. So y'all need to go on her, their DMs and be mad at them, because I ain't, you know, don't shoot the messenger. But let's get into the voicemail. Let's do it. Yo, what up? L'Oreal. Wax. I love y'all. Been listening to y'all for a hot minute now. Uh, I'm going to get straight to the point before this voicemail cuts me off. Uh, after I got divorced, I started going to church, trying to get my life back, trying to be better like wax. And, uh, I was doing good. I ended up meeting this older lady. You know, we fucked around. We were doing our thing, whatnot. And then I went to church a couple of weeks later and the pastor called his family on stage Yo, long story short, I've been fucking the pastor's wife. No. And I don't know what to do. Ooh. I don't know who to tell. <laughs> Jesus. I can't tell the pastor, right? No. I don't know. The pastor got a shotgun. Uh, maybe y'all can help me out, Wax. I know that your dad's a preacher. Yes, he got a shotgun. What if he said it's your mom? <laughs> Uh, so Cut that. All right. <laughs> you fucking crazy ass girl. <laughs> this girl's- yeah. <laughs> your mom ain't right. Why she did Shut that? Shut your mouth. Okay. <laughs> mom, she didn't mean it. No, I didn't. You know how he the Lord, said it. You know how the Lord say, Lord, please forgive them. They know not what they do. Boom. Crazy. He said it. I didn't. I'm just. You definitely the say that crazy. Um. 
I mean, listen, let me tell you this right now. The pastor got a shotgun. Yeah. First, <laughs> the pastor got a shotgun. Do not tell him. Do not tell none of the deacons because they mad that the pastor you make him do a bunch of shit. And they oh, got that on the his deacons wife. is fucking too. They probably been fucking. Somebody, yeah. deacon somebody. You fuck ain't it. special, nigga. She fucks him up. Doing it. That's why I say shut the fuck up. Stay in line. And you're going to be a deacon soon. Shut the fuck up. You want to be a deacon? She already ordained you. You already done. She baptized you, baby. She baptized you. Shut the fuck up. No, but that's mad grimy. Know, First of all, switch bucking. churches immediately. ASAPZ. Second of all, leave the preacher's wife alone. Who fucks the preacher's wife? Denzel Washington and the preacher's <laughs> wife. Oh, he did? Almost, right? He almost took a... He was yeah. the angel and shit, and he fell in love with Whitney. Uh, he ain't shit. But yo, the preacher's wife is like this nice, pure lady who like really pushes her. Man, they like really great. No, women, not this man. one. Yeah, she pushing them and she pushing a whole lot of other people. She too. pushing and pulling. She is. If you know what I mean. I don't know nothing. She passed his wife. Tugging and rubbing. Is what about the um Whitney Houston, right? Wasn't she on something? Drugs. <laughs> <laughs> what? I thought she was on what is what she not on the fucking uh, what's The bodyguard. Pre- okay, the bodyguard, right? Preacher's wife, bodyguard. Well, all right, the preacher's wife. Wait in Texas Hill. I think it's the preacher's wife when she's um somebody's wife, right? <laughs> <laughs> I just broke down the whole scenario and yeah. everything. I, I Denzel that. Washington was the angel. Okay. Well, he was trying to so become he, an he, angel. He was a twerk god. What? Okay, I'm just trying to what? bring it together. I'm just trying to bring it together. Twerk god was Denzel Washington. And then Jason Lee would be Whitney Houston. Whitney Houston. There we go. Bam, that's what I was trying to get at. Most of we on the same page. Yeah, we are. <laughs> Turn it. Okay, no, but really, um, you're violating times 10. Yes, you are. Uh, you're going to go to hell if you don't get the fuck out of Dodge. ASAP. Like, I just feel like, you know she ain't shit. She fucking you, first of all. And you talking about you trying to get your life together yeah. and you end up getting worse situations. I, but yeah, that's how, that's how it usually happens. The devil is, uh, is a fucked up person. That's why you're supposed to di- keep your dick in your pants. That's what God was trying to tell yeah, you. Yeah, but he's trying to do to be try that. But, you know, the devil just comes in and swoop in with, like, the lady smell. The, 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 the church ladies had this fucking smell that's like, come fuck me. That's what the smell is? I don't think yeah. so. Yeah. Did I just say that out loud? Yes, yeah, nasty. <laughs> But you, you know, you know, you know the cologne, like not the cologne, but perfume, the, the perfume shit that they they dump it on them. And when they walk past, it's like you smell them, and it's like, Turk guy, this shit don't get hard when them motherfuckers walk past like that. You want to get smell the aroma? You smell it. You know, the, it, it got the pussy with it. You know what I'm saying? Because the pussy marinate so much that they ain't getting none. He be looking at the ushers like, come here. Let I don't me be doing that no more. Yes, you do. You're young. You look at the ushers. You know, what I'm everybody gotta have a skirt on and stuff. Am I saying this? Yes. <laughs> I don't watch it no more. Then, you know when you ain't cheating a while, you just start looking at anything as sexy. That's what you sound like. <laughs> <laughs> you like just the back of that fucking heel. <laughs> that, the, the wedge heel that they wear, the white shoes. Oh, you, you know what I'm talking it. about. Yo, you know what? You know who's really like that? Married men is really like that, though. They've been coming to me for years. I showed them a fucking uh, half a titty. I'm like, look at a girl titty. Before I get to the good stuff, I show them like the girl half a titty like this. You like look and at the shoulder. You start scrolling. They, 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 they like, oh. oh my gosh, oh, oh wax the man. Oh yeah, you my friend. I'm gonna see you next time. I'm like, bro, this ain't shit. That comes. But now that's me, you. This is me right now. I gotta live through somebody else. A twerk god. When he seen you, and I don't want to see that. Ah! <laughs> did you just ask to see Jason? No, I did not. Oh. I just, I just uh, listen. I was just saying, like, the text message and shit. But the rest of the shit, the pictures, you keep to yourself, bro. Okay. So um, our advice to you mm-hmm. is leave her ass alone. Leave her alone. Let that man have his wife. Yes. And let somebody else let tell the, that re- she cheating. Yeah, let the fucking rest of the deacons get caught. One of the, one of the deacons going to get caught one day in the office, man. It happens all the time. And that's it. Yeah, beat it. Find somebody yes, of all the bitches you could oh, be but fucking. But listen, all the ladies in church, right? They like divorced or they like going through problems. That's why they did. Church is like a hospital. Right. So then why he had to go for the preacher's wife? It's mad bitches. He should. He ain't know. I don't think he knew. That he wasn't really going to church. No, he was going to church, but they, they stay in there. They horny. No, you would know who your preacher's wife is because she's sitting up front. She in yeah, the, you know what I mean? Must she must have been downstairs cooking or something. He was just plotting on her from the beginning, probably. I didn't know, but when she got on the stage, yes, you did, nigga. Do I feel bad that I'm just saying this type of stuff? Nope. 
Okay. Next caller. <laughs> What's up, Wax Mario? So I decided to give you guys a call because, I don't know, I got an issue. I mean, it might not even be an issue, but I've been dating my nigga for three years, and I honestly think that he has an addiction to eating ass. Like, this nigga seems to be, like, always want to eat my ass. In the beginning, like, when we first got together, it was cool. I was like, oh, okay, my nigga nasty. I like that shit. He likes to eat ass. But now it's just become, like, a problem because he wants to do it all the time. Like, to the point where I used to take, like, uh, do sugar scrubs every time I took a bath, every time I, you know, shower, whatever. I like to do sugar scrubs for my skin. And I know I'm a pretty clean person. I stay clean. It ain't even like I got a big ass ass or no shit like that. Like, my shit's just regular. But he will, uh, he'll always say this shit's sweet, da 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 And then, like, it's to the point where, my nigga, you don't have to eat my ass every fucking time like we'll be somewhere we'll be at a party we'll be you know cook out it don't matter he uh pull me in the bathroom somewhere or pull something i just want to eat your ass let me eat your ass real quick and you know i used to oblige but now well i kind of still do oblige but at the same time it's just like fuck again my nigga you want to eat my ass again like is that a real addiction or am I just tripping and just should appreciate the fact that my man always want to have his face in my ass. I don't know. It's just, it's good, but it's just become to the point where yeah, I'm Yeah, exactly. Hate. Listen, you're not the only person. You're just one of the people who's getting their ass. He, he loved to do that shit. If somebody loved to do that shit and they got a fucking, it's, it's like a car you're going down the, down the street and you see the gas station. If you need gas at that time, you want to eat ass at that time, he's going to eat that person's ass. So He's addicted. He's addicted to eating ass. I mean, I've known a guy that was addicted to eating pussy, but like ass is Are just... you mad at that guy like she is? No. That's what I'm saying. Like I was like... I never heard nobody <laughs> complaining about... I was about, like, you ready now? <laughs> but the ass might be like too swampy, like... No, I mean, like, I like on. getting my ass ate, but it's just like... Ah. The di- because the difference... Shut up. The difference is, like, obviously, like, your pussy's going to feel a little better. Like It's it, always wet, right? It's not just that. I think because, uh, like, you can make someone come from eating their pussy like this. Not like this, but if you know what you're doing. Yeah, peace. From your ass, you're not coming from your ass. All you're going to do is make Girls your pussy. Girls come from their ass. I mean, not from, a t- not from getting my ass ate. I never, like. That'd be crazy. If, if anybody on here, can y'all please tell me if y'all came from somebody eating your ass? Like, and maybe your pussy will come because oh, it's, okay. yeah, it's okay, possible. Okay. But, like, my thing is, like, if you're eating my ass, it's just making my pussy wetter. So, what are we doing after this? Like, I got is no he condom. Gonna, is he going to, y'all? <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Yikes. Well, you said motherfuckers is hitting raw left and right. They're so. bugging. They must ain't got nobody they love or they don't love themselves. It's really dangerous. <laughs> That's a fact. Dangerous, That's a fact. Man. Especially. If you out here still cheating, nigga. You ain't shit. <laughs> I ain't even gonna say nothing. I'm gonna just let it go. I don't want to say nothing. But yeah, I don't. So, did, have you ever had something like sexually that you were like addicted to, um, or not maybe addicted, but that you really, really liked? Your go to. I, I would like. I love head. I like to smoke and just get head for mad long. Like when I know that I'm about to nut or whatever. I used getting blue balls. I was getting fucking heads for so long. I was just loving head. I just walk, walk around the house and get head. I was just like, I'm about to go over here, walk with me. She'd be on her knees going like this. And I used to make her just walk down. Just Everywhere I go, I go in the cabinets for no reason. I was going to the fucking cabinets knowing I ain't got nothing in there. Just to say I open the cabinets getting head. I want to open the refrigerator getting head. So you're I'll walking around stove. with your Tim's on, with your uh, pants around your legs. Fit it to turn back. And the bitch kneeling wherever you kneel. Walking like this. Ashen on her head. <laughs> Because when you walk, day. yeah, one yeah. Day it when you sure. walk, the ash got to fall off. Like you yeah. ain't gonna run to the ashtray with the bitch yeah. there. I, I, this is back in the day, so I used to do all that. You ain't shit, boy. Do you, we all want to do all type of different type of shit and sex. That's all. No, I will say that, like, 
there was one guy that I was with that, like, all the time I just gave him head. But he was, like, addicted to it. Yeah. Like, we still had sex and shit, obviously. But it was like, a, I think he was addicted to it. And after a while, yeah. I'm like, this nigga need help. Yo, you know what I, I mean? I'm like, like yeah, yo, at first serious. it was cool. I'm like, all right, yeah, yeah. But after my jaw, it felt broke. A like, whole new jawline. A whole new world. <laughs> like, nigga, I was just, no. Like, one time my shit felt swollen. I'm like, I got to stop fucking with this nigga. Like, now I have standards of, like, if your dick is too big, nigga, I will cut you off. If you, like, certain things, it, it will make me cut a nigga off. Like, I've said that before that I've cut a nigga off because his dick was too big. You don't remember me saying that? I heard that before. <laughs> take that, take that. Okay. Yo, y'all. <laughs> Did you see the comment somebody wrote? Talk right. about you need to, yeah, they was like, you need to take a voice memo. Say, take that, take that. And every time oh, yeah. you want to, I was like, shut up. Yeah. <laughs> we want to hear it. The you fuck up. That. That's not going to work, nigga. No. No. <laughs> no. No. Wrong. Peace. First of all, uh, we didn't hear you guys I did again. take that, take oh, okay, that. I wasn't sure so I heard it. Okay. First of all, a big dick doesn't like matter to me. I I don't think the size of it. Even but matters. would you run away from one? Because I, you know, that's my forte. <laughs> How big was the dick? It was huge. Like <laughs> it's two times that this has happened to me, and it was like I had to reconsider it because I'm like, do I want? Because I got it. Like, this is the pussy I'm living with forever. The thickness of your mic. Like that's what the fuck are you doing? This is crazy. The this thickness whole of the thing? mic. No, no, not the whole oh. thing. That's what I'm saying. Is that how big? Like how big? I say like a um. <laughs> that like, thick too. Yes. And well, I'm, well, I'm just I'm like, like here. I'm like the end of the mic. I, <laughs> I'm like the end of the mic. You're like the tip right down yes, here. Yes, this is where I'm at. No, I'm talking about like I'm, I'm balling. Monstrous out. to the point where I'm like, how do people have dicks like this? <laughs> no, for real, because like. It's too big. Uh oh, this guy is like, like who like, is like, it? Like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> a twerk guy's like, you twerking. Oh, fuck you. I hate you, yo. What is, is wrong with you, bro? What the fuck is going on over here? Oh, like, you, you, you smiling? You in the DMs already? He said, what's his name? <laughs> <laughs> he knew what time it was, too. He's like, I know I ain't gonna get this nigga. I can get this nigga. <laughs> Let me see what's up with this. Yeah, one. cause you was acting oh. unavailable. <laughs> I, got me a, I got me a whole girlfriend. I'm happy. You're Fuck so that. High. I know. Yo, First I, I, time I, in yes. your life. Yo, I never did nothing. Play Stevie Wonder for once in my life. I, know. <laughs> I never heard that. All right. But you heard Pastor Troy, nigga. Yes. That nigga was singing mad Pastor Troy songs we never heard. I'd have sung the wrong damn song. Yeah, nigga, he little, was another nigga. Little guy. I'm singing a little scrappy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, did we have, give her advice? Yes, yeah, stop fucking the fucking um, no, pastor. That's the wrong no. person. Oh. <laughs> stop getting your ass. Okay, I know how to get. I'm, I'm going to take a wax advice on this. Let I'm going to give her wax advice since she didn't she answer. Got. All right, you want her to stop eating your ass? <laughs> Take a shit. Talk to me. <laughs> <laughs> I knew nigga. you were like that. Hey, let's go. Take a let's shit. Go. <laughs> said, Talk to me. Take a shit. Forget to wipe. And then when she goes to eat your ass and she tastes pennies and. What you mean, she? He. He. I thought it was two girls. No. no. You think about the. <laughs> oh, I'm mixing bitches up too. <laughs> Fuck. We're all mixing people up. You be a wax for real. When he, <laughs> so when he wants to eat your ass. Well, we do got a lot of lesbian callers. We get it. Right? Guess, yeah, but she's Okay, like, but hey. this one isn't. Oh, then. Okay, um, so when he goes to eat your ass, shit. And don't wipe your ass. Yeah, yeah. Right? Be, that's listen, a whack. I like that answer. one. No, Loria, I promise you that's the one of the best things you ever say right there. <laughs> I can't this believe really you great. didn't say it. I was actually disappointed listen, in I, you. I, I was coming back for it, but no, you, you did it. I, you forgot. Listen, you was moving to the next call. I, I, could, I could put the flowers and stuff on it, the, <laughs> um, the shit on it. What, what is it? Whipped cream? Yeah. You put on the um, chicken. All right. Whatever. Whipped cream on chicken? Hot sauce and applesauce. All right. You don't put applesauce on chicken. You never had applesauce on chicken? Y'all try that. Get the chicken tenders from um from um Are you pregnant? Shut up. You are? I don't know. Um You about to get served again. <laughs> <laughs> I hated that you was right there. Yeah. Anybody else in the fucking world? I did not want L'Oreal and, 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 and Angela Yee watching me get served. 
<laughs> like, what the fuck? I just turned around. I, I ain't touched that shit. Like, don't fucking touch. Charlotte ain't talking about, go back again. Go back. I'm not going to get that shit. She served me. I ain't seen nothing. Let's go. Let me tell you something. <laughs> this motherfucker did a Michael Jackson five spin <laughs> and handed him the paper like, <laughs> And then, <laughs> who's bad? The nigga uh, was like, he put his hands back and let that shit fall on the ground. Shit got all his information on it. Well, it's going to happen again, so get that child support ready, my friend. Yeah, that child support man. money. God bless everybody. All right, um, so we're going to get into this email. This is a new thing we're doing because yeah. people have been DMing and shit like that. It's so mostly if, from blind people, though, right? Yeah, the blind people wrote us an email. Oh. Um, but anyway, so so uh, you can write an email, and our email is bully and the beast. Oh, bully and the beast at gmail dot com, baby, motherfucker. I still got a Yahoo. Okay, just kidding. All right, so this is anonymous. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm sorry, I can't. Take that, take that. Oh, oh I, 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 I was hearing something. <laughs> that is crazy. Um, okay, so background story. This is about um, a man. He's in a relationship. Um, he they're in the thirties, so he and his, he wants to spice things up with his wife, and so she finally was like, "All right, we'll get a threesome, whatever." Or no, they wanted to do a swinger, so she ended up finding a girl that she works with, and um, her husband and they did a swinging situation. No. So you could start from. The backstory. Okay. Backstory. He is a dark skinned nigga. All my wife's exes are dark, so although she won't admit it, she likes that that she likes that. It has been her type before. I'm light and so is she. <clears throat> After a few weeks, we set up a Saturday night to meet at a suite in NYC. We're from Jersey. The plan was to meet up, see how things felt, and go from there. No pressure on her or do I say the names? Yeah. Mm-hmm. No, you can't. Because he said we're just going to call her TT. Okay. No pressure on her or TT. Me and my wife went out to dinner and had some drinks at the bar to calm her nerves. I got to put my blunt down because now this is about to get good. Yeah, we go. Okay. Do-do-do. To calm her nerves. We set up some rules. Condoms are mandatory yes. if we were to go through with it. If we didn't feel comfortable, we bounce and head back home. I was so excited. I had wood the whole time at the bar (laughs) thinking about the pussy I was about to get. I think I had blue chew. (laughs) Get to the suite, meet them. Shit is mad awkward. The dude J rolls up an L and we all smoke. My wife and I haven't smoked in 10 years, so we was buzzed. Uh-huh. Took some shots and I suggest we play uh-huh. truth or dare to loosen up. I know that's mad old, but it works. It works. I dared TT to kiss my wife and she did. My wife eventually started kissing her back and it jumped off from there. My wife is faded. She dares everyone to strip ass naked. I was like, fuck it. And we all get butt naked. I see my wife's eyes is locked on dude's package and she is on it. So I looked over and he is blessed. And not even really hard. (laughs) I was immediately fucked up. All the way, because I knew then it was a mistake. We pair up. Me. (laughs) We pair up. Me with TT and my wife with Jay, of course. Jay with the big dick. (laughs) No, you didn't say that. You didn't say that. I added that. Okay. But I. (laughs) I'm so in my head, my dick won't get hard. Then he went from wood <laughs> to he wish he and would. You hear your wife getting pounded. Ah, ah. TT sucked my dick for a minute, but I could not focus because my wife is sucking and fucking baby legs. <laughs> what the fuck? He is way thicker than me and a few inches longer, so I was feeling less than. Yes. The passionate way she sucked him off was something she had never done with me <gasps> in 13 years. So, yeah. <laughs> The kicker came when he laid on the bed and my wife climbed on top of him, slid in him with no condom on. I said, bitch, that's not what we agreed on. It's like he didn't say that part either. I heard it. I like this. I like this. I like this. But when I called her name, she acted like she didn't hear me. I don't hear shit. I got this meat in me. No, it's just the, you know what I'm saying. Wow. Yeah. What the lady saying? Would you like for me to stop? No, man. Shut up. Shut up. Okay. 
<laughs> Eventually, TT left me and they basically had a threesome. My wife's pussy was so wet and creamy, I damn near cried because she never came like that for me. <laughs> bitch, was, bitch was convulsing and having spasms and shit. She even ate TT's pussy when a nigga Whoa. fucked that dog. I was crushed. My wife was a complete freak. Who was this bitch? You slut. <laughs> I can't take this. Throwing it back and speaking Spanish while getting oh, dug out, my dog. <laughs> I felt like I couldn't stop it because this is what I pushed for and begged oh. to get her to do. And I let her do it. Oh. Eventually, I pulled it together and fucked this whack ass bitch, TT. <laughs> <laughs> but, but he didn't say that part, but he said, and fuck TT. I like this. But it was weak, I admit it. So ever since that night, our relationship has been hella off. Sex off, communication off, we just aren't clicking. <laughs> Last weekend, I saw her search history on her iPad it was all Pornhub. BBC shit. <laughs> Big black cock. And I was pissed. Since we wasn't <laughs> fucking like we used to. No. The times are the to- Wait, what? The times no are all times when I when I'm at work or out the house and she's up in here masturbating the bigger dicks than mine. Like, really? So my question is, do you think my marriage is done? Fucked up. Done. Can we stay together? No. Is she or has she been fucking Jay and or Always, TT? for sure. Behind my back? Of course. You at work. When I brung up that night, she said she was drunk and high and out of character. But I feel I like that's remember. the real her. I don't remember. I Am I wrong? I look at her totally different now and don't feel like the man no more when I'm around her because I got a little dick. Little meat. I fucked up asking for this. It got what I wanted and shit went all wrong. South, baby. But I don't want to lose my family over this. You had to. Help me out and give me your thoughts. Please keep me anonymous. Nope. My name is... No, I'm joking. I ain't gonna say his name. My name is... I ain't gonna say who? his name. My name is... But I got his name. My name is... But I would never do you dirty like that. I will, Keith. <laughs> Shut up. That's not his name. Um, damn, this was a good It's over. Start. The bigger meat always win. <laughs> the bigger meat make you the one fucking want to leave their whole, their whole family, true. the kids and everything. I'm telling you. It depends on how big the meat was. I told you if it's too big, then you know you got to get up out of here. That's what she's looking for. I need, that, need. I need this pussy forever. She don't care about that right now. She That shit would make her convulge or whatever they call it. It was making her fucking nut crazy. That's all she's looking for. This motherfucker been her 13 years. She didn't even suck his dick like that. It's yeah, over yeah. for him. I really, I'm thinking hard about a situation. And like, I like I had the perfect person. Everything perfect. But the, the dick, the, it was satisfying, but not enough. And then I always thought, like, dear, can I live with this dick for the rest of my life? And I don't think so. And I don't want to be a cheating, lying whore. Yeah. It's not <clears> good. No. It's, it sucks. More than one penis a year, you're a whore. Shut up. So tell that to yourself. I was. <laughs> Yo, this is just too easy. <laughs> Why? I don't anyway, know. um, so yeah, I uh, yikes. Yeah. You better go marry TT. <laughs> no, that whack ass. You know what? Because you know them two gonna be fucking for a while. So you know what? TT, you little whack, you down at his level. You sound like you sound like you more of TT. Yeah, you more yeah, TT. You, you more caught TT. a week, and guess what you are? Yep, little meat. You weak. So weak deserves weak. No, that's yeah. not nice. That's not nice. Yo, like get some sea moss, bro. Blue chew, nigga. Sea oh. moss, blue chew, all that. But yeah, they make my meat look like even bigger. And I didn't even shave my fucking um, my, my hair. No, but I do think it's crazy that now you're catching her. And she might have already been looking at this, but now you're yeah. insecure and you're looking at it. Why don't you have a conversation <laughs> with her? No, really. Keep it real. Like, to be honest, yeah. he should have a conversation with her and just be like, listen, I don't know what the fuck was going on with you and Jay, but I ain't like that shit. You be my real. wife. Yeah. We already. First of all, why the fuck? My nigga, did you let her fuck this nigga raw? raw? Are you crazy? You stupid ass nigga. nigga. Now you gotta really leave her. That's your bitch. That's your shit. Like, how dare you? Come on, Just man. sit there and watch her do, and then you put on a, a condom to fuck TT. Other bitch. You should have nothing than fucking TT, you dumb motherfucker. You should have got TT pregnant to word, make us see how you feel. Word is born. You, you know what I'm saying? Come like, on, yeah, now. yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? I watch nah. my ass too. <laughs> <laughs> 
touch his hand. Shut up. It's 2020. I don't shit in my hand no more. Um, no, but for real. Um, nah, for real, y'all. You why not... would you let this nigga fuck your bitch Sure, raw? You seen that shit? TT gets pregnant that day. Nigga, I would have karate chopped that nigga's dick from the front Look, of my, I shot, I did my, whim, my I woman's did pussy if I yeah. was him. Yeah, I, I would have like like stabbed that shit or something if my nigga meat bigger than my fucking my girl. Like, you just don't like, doing? and then like when you see her even about to even, whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah. You didn't want to look like the hater, that's what it was. On, but guess who, what you look like right now? You look kind of uh, stupid. insecure you, hater. Yo, I did that because somebody was putting regular gas in my fucking car. So I'm like, Whoa, 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 what the fuck are you about to do? Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, and that's a car. And that's a car, fam. That's a car. This is your your lady. This is your wife. I not, can't not, believe it. Not, not just some girl. This is your wife. And she violated. Yeah. Well, she was blaming that she was drunk, he said, right? Yeah, but listen, you. you I mean, the car, the car going to sit there, the car going to put whatever it's going to put in there. If she's drunk and you know that, and this is your wife, and you know, because you know when she's drunk, drunk. Yeah. And when she's too drunk to, and her, her, right frame of mind. her guidance is yes. impaired, you, husband, yes. are supposed to fucking Guide be there. Her, you fucking idiot. You know why else? Because if that nigga has fucking AIDS, now oh, you have it, dummy. You dumbass. And what if he done in her? Dumbass. Now you taking care of his kid. You and you have to. And he got up. a bigger dick. No, you have to because he got a bigger dick. And his son meat going to be bigger than yours. Ooh. And you got to take care of him. Your son's meat is going to be bigger <laughs> than yours. <laughs> no, but for real, yo, you Sucks to be bug you. the fuck out. Yeah, yeah. And I mean, all right, so it's spilled milk now, right? He yes. fucked it. He, she fucked raw. So what now? Got to go. Conversation. No. I, no get, They're married. If you got fuck her sister or something like somebody. No. You he agreed to this. Pain. I know, but he gotta do something. He further it. agreed when he didn't stop her from fucking raw. You gotta find somebody to nut in. You, he did, TT. No, he he don't want TT. TT whack. <laughs> Cause if his weak ass said TT whack, TT a different level under this nigga. He <laughs> <laughs> was no TT. TT a freak freak. Cause she was there for Jay fucking... don't give a fuck. I don't think that's Jay wife. I think they just do that. <laughs> T.T. was getting her pussy ate and everything. <laughs> I think Jay and T.T. is just like some people who got together say we married so we get couples. Did he say that T.T. and Jay was married? Yeah, they supposed to be so They supposed to be couples Oh, swinging they couple. swinging couple. He didn't say that. Swinging. They didn't say. She, the bitch work at her job and the other bitch. <laughs> T.T. work at, the, at her job. Take that, take that. It Thank says, you. after a month of me bringing up suggestions and researching online, we had nothing. I eventually suggested this freak bitch she works with. The girl is bad as fuck and I've only seen her at their company parties throughout the years. They're cool but not friends, so it was a long shot. My wife did not shoot me down and said she would fill her out. Fast forward a month later, they went out to a few happy hours and got friendly. Man, they probably fucked. They plotted on this bitch. Yo. They been got her. <laughs> they plotted. The they girl, been got her, bro. The girl will call TT even stop by her house briefly for a cookout we were having. Blah, yeah. blah, blah. She, but that's why she ate her pussy with no problem. Yeah. So she been it, doing it. It says. That's it? her bitch. That's her shit. That ain't even yours. Yo, you think that's the first time she went raw on this nigga? You that's th- why no. I was so comfortable going raw. Do you think that's oh, yeah. the first time TT and her had a threesome? Exactly. Because he With says, this nigga in the T-T, he says, TT was down. My wife forwarded me a pic of TT's man, and I was not worried. Smaller dude will call him Jay. That's uh, right. So that's their boyfriend and girlfriend. Mm, no, no. They gave him a, a different picture. That's not the right guy. <laughs> Jay was Jay. no. He didn't say no. he was small. The dick wasn't small. No, the guy the was guy small. was small. He was short. He was yeah. like little no, dude. So he slept on him. Yeah. He was like, oh, this little midget. Oh, sorry. Fuck. Damn. This little people. Little he guy. ain't good. This little guy. He ain't gonna do shit. And then he the he like yeah. I don't have no legs because it's all in my dick. <laughs> it is, no, I ain't got no legs. in your wife. <laughs> <laughs> this is all in my third leg. Is in your wife. <laughs> Damn, so yeah, I don't think y'all should break up though because y'all agreed to do this. It's just that she violated and you need to find out the truth. <laughs> like, it, it might not even be up to you to break up because cause, uh, what you call a wifey might got a whole nother life you're mm-hmm. not aware mm-hmm. of. Because how she just got this bitch to just flip this bitch so quick she said he said a couple happy hours. Next thing you know, she was eating her pussy and fucking her raw. <laughs> fucking like raw. that's a lot. And that's you a got whole lot, fam. not only that, you got your nigga fucking your bitch you don't even know like that <laughs> raw. 
Fibs. Come on. All it is is a right, fucking you know disaster. This is Throw for, the whole relationship yeah. away. This is for the 10-year relationship. I'm the, sorry, I can't. Take that, take that. Okay. This is for, <laughs> it says, for our 10-year anniversary, I was begging for something to spice up the sex life. <laughs> Ten Whoa. years. Yeah, <laughs> now you got a like, divorce. Yeah, that's that's nice <laughs> up. A divorce, and um, I think you know what I think he should do though. For real, I think he should do um, like cleanse himself. I think he should just put some uh, peroxide, uh, some salt, pepper, and obey seasoning. Uh, shake it up a little bit and drink that. It's gonna help you out, nigga. Go to the doctor with your wife and make sure that that nigga yeah, Jay ain't burner. <laughs> yeah, like, and then and and then fucking st- take her computer and bash it on the ground. No, because you got all mad Jay pictures. <laughs> <laughs> she don't need a Jay picture. She looking at. She trying to find a memorization of his. I can't even say. It, I would love to of his he, dick. I would love to know what he do for a living because if he's when he's at work, she's fucking Jay. Where's her? I thought she had a job. This bitch is at home masturbating for a living. Yeah, that's what she said. <laughs> well, listen, Jay's <laughs> friend. Take that, take that says she's a successful manager at a big company. And okay. he owns his own business. Damn, they got your bitch, man. Damn. They stole her. It's not your bitch no more, bro. But she's going to eventually find out that the she sex... She belongs to the streets. Yeah, but once once the sex, once the sex start going down, because Jay's going to eventually tired of fucking her, too. I mean, it's just new pussy right now. Facts. And TT, she's already what? So, like, now she's going to be like, But TT got a big is. dick. TT? The, the nigga is hers. I get it. But That's they, her but big dick. I get it, but she, yes, I'm saying, so they're going to eventually leave her alone. Now she got to worry about her family. TT probably sex. not even whack. It was just that that nigga was so busy oh, looking his at his dick. All his feelings and stuff like yeah. that. Yeah. He can't barely get hard and stuff. And then you got to put a condom on a half hard meat. You got to put a condom on a half hard meat to watch your wife get fucked raw. <laughs> By the same bitch that he just was fucking raw too. So he was fucking everybody raw. You the only and you the only dumbass who put a condom on. <laughs> no, he was the smart one. <laughs> Actually. He wanted to fill that pussy, bro. That's why you gotta be like me and don't cheat. This story makes me sad. I'm not sad. I'm happy that this fuck this shit really this fucking coming out. This shit always happen. No, it only makes me sad because I'm like, damn, y'all, you really got a small dick and there's nothing you could do about it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> nothing you can do about it. <laughs> like, you know how many things I put? I put a fucking weight on my meat to try to make Please this shit Please don't do it. that. Don't I did. Do when I was younger, I put a fucking weight on a string. I, I put that, put a string around it and I tried to make that shit hang. That shit hurt. Uh, <laughs> Like I used to, I used to pull it all the time. I used to pull it. People think I'm jerking off. I ain't jerking off. I'm just pulling. I've shit. heard guys really do that before. I try to pull like it. Like they try to pull their shit. I pull that shit mad time. Did it ever shit. grow? That shit ain't mother. This shit's fucking fucked up, man. <laughs> you know my shit like curved is fucked up, man. I think a curve will fuck shit up too. No, no, sometimes. no, no. My shit was broke. My shit broke. My shit like broke. It's like go like. You like a curve, T Diddy Smith. Smith don't have sex. Does it still, does it still get hard like the same way? It's, I'm it's, about you've it never I'm like, seen a curve one. Never, and not so, too much of a curve. I've so I've felt this one. It's like off. Unless it's curving the way that your curve goes. That's what I'm saying. Girls got a curve? You ever seen a dildo that kind of like curves? You never seen those? Yeah. My shit like flat. <laughs> like the earth? Right? No, look. <laughs> No, it's like this. It's like this. It's like this is like this. Boom, like straight. You thing. got flat dick. It's, it's fucked up. <laughs> so your shit goes like a. It's L. broke. It's like this. It's like broke, like this, like a fucking L. Take that, take that. I want my friend to call in because she was telling me about how she was about to have sex with a nigga, but like it literally was like so curved that it had they had to do some like different positions. Oh, see, that's some I weird. I've never seen it. Like, even I know, like... Listen, I know all the positions because it's the only ones you can do. Nah, that shit don't... It's, it's, it's harder to fuck a nigga with a curved dick, yeah. I think. All right. Smith, you don't have sex. <laughs> Smith, you have to get a word for you. Smith got to talk. But what what, 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 what the Smith got to say, though? Because my whole thing is, like, when you're riding, I'm like, do you have to ride at an angle? Like, I'm just... That's the thing, Smith. like, no, because, like, you, you, the shit will move to the way, but if it's, you're not used to that, it's weird. It, like, shifts shit. Yes, it shifts shit a little bit. And that's what I'm saying. Like, I, like, a big d- curved dick is dangerous. Like, you don't want right. to... That shit I'm, might I'm, hurt I'm, you. I'm sorry. We started talking about a, about a lot of fucking penis today. Smith... You don't do anything. You got dick. You're going to take you to fucking church. 
right? I got eyelash glue on my shirt. I'm you, know, I'm a, you know I'm sorry singing my gospel. Right, well, you see what's happening in church now. <laughs> <laughs> Preachers' wives y'all. is getting fucked. Help me, y'all. What y'all doing? Y'all, I'm over here talking great about it. And your pastor's wife getting smashed. Okay, so did you hear about the kid? Uh, we're going to get into black excellence. Yeah. Did you hear about the kid DeAndre Arnold? And he's the kid that um, he had dreadlocks or has dreadlocks. And mm-hmm. he came back to school after winter break like regular kids do he only has a few months left till he graduates Mm -hmm. and the school changed the policy while the kids were out and basically the rules and the rules it said that he couldn't have dreads anymore (laughs) now at first like i think they said something like he had to keep it up so he like it it couldn't be a certain length or something so he would keep it in you know tied up in a ponytail bun whatever so yeah so now they're saying all together so um, I know Ellen donated $20,000 mm-hmm. to get like towards his uh, college fund. Um, and now also um, the director of the movie Hair Love invited DeAndre to the Oscars. Oh. So it was like uh, he may not be able to go to school right now, but he's getting all these great things to happen yeah, for I'm him. Not at y'all. I appreciate y'all. Yeah, I do think that that's a little disgusting. I mean, especially in the middle of the school year. Yeah, I he's about to graduate? That's like, what I'm saying, on, in a man. few months. And I just feel like if, it, if this was the policy, at least just say... From mm-hmm. September, even though I think it's fucked up. Regardless, yeah. You know what I mean? But at least, how you just going to change it in the middle of the fucking school year? Whack. So now he can't graduate, but he's been going to the school all this time. So, um... He's going to get a blessing off that. I see the, I see this story going in a positive direction because it came so disgusting. Right, but I'm pretty sure graduating is important for Very him. important. Yeah, so, yeah. um... Hair Love is actually one of the only black... Uh, film, if I'm not mistaken. <laughs> he gonna sit there and be like, yo, people walking around with dresses on. You know what I'm saying? But you don't think he's gonna have like a suit? I don't know what's going on. I don't even know what the Oscars is. I'm just talking. Okay. I'm mixing up with runways. So, Hair Love is nominated for the best animated short Oscars series, whatever. Respect. Okay, so um, let's move on. We're gonna get straight into Savage News. Yeah. So people are eating cereal out of other people's mouths. Good job. I've seen that stupid shit. Like I didn't see it. Can we see this? They just pour the milk in the mouth and fucking like put the spoon oh in Oh, my God, no. Like a bowl? Yes. They're using the mouths as a bowl. That's fucking gross. It's disgusting. Who do you think made that up? White people. <laughs> White people. <laughs> Facts. Yo, there was, I seen a couple on the stairs spitting each other's mouths. Yeah. Dumb shit. You see this stupid ass shit? Yeah, this bitch is about to die. Stupid motherfucker. Why then, wouldn't they just And then these dudes getting their girlfriends to do this dumb shit. But it really don't count because these motherfuckers be kissing their girls, though. Yeah, but I think kissing and eating cereal out of somebody's mouth Same like thing. it's a bowl. Same thing. It's gross. First of all, I don't even want nobody to eat off of a fucking spoon that I, or especially something like cereal. Shit, I ain't got no say so. I mean, that's my girl. I already kissed you. Uh-uh, and, I'm sorry. I don't yeah. care. We could kiss. We could fuck. You could eat my ass, but we can't share a spoon. I'm sorry. What's the difference, though? It's gross. You ever know when people take the spoon out and it still be like saliva? So you look at the nasty, that's on the nasty it, dude you with. It make me want to throw that up. The guy's nasty. No, I'm talking about anything, a kid or anything. You know when you take something that's like leftover food on the fork still? or That's oh, fucking yeah. gross. You get the wrong people. Yeah. This guy is almost gay, right? The guy you with? No. No. <laughs> oh. I don't know. How anybody. you almost gay anyway? Shut the Uh-oh. ass, the ass, the oh. tart guy. <laughs> he's he's one, almost, he's going to get his ass. Yo. Yeah, he is. What, you, you want to put a bet on this? Yeah. Are we I'm betting ba- the I'm same be- thing? No. <laughs> no, no, I got your back. I, I got your back, okay? How are we going to bet on the same team? But listen, I, when you win, I want you to fucking give me half of the money that I give you. All right? But I got your okay. back. I'm going to bet against you. I'm going to bet against her. I'm saying that you're not going to do it. All right. You're not going to do it, L'Oreal. You say he is? You're going to bet $100. He's never going to tell us. Well, you know, I bet you $200, right? 
And I just give me a hundred dollars back when you win. Okay, give me the two hundred now. <laughs> 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 then we could do it. Y'all, this shit is fucking nasty. I don't know. I think it's nasty. So you're down to do it. You and your girlfriend. They're down to do what? Eat the cereal out of her mouth. Oh, I, I don't think we'll do that. I mean, yeah, but you you said what is the difference, y'all kiss? No, I get it, but I, I'm, she gonna choke. I ain't got time to be trying to help her. All right, so you shit. put it in your mouth and she can eat it out of yours. That's um, gross. If I if I got some food in my mouth and then you kiss and then you switch the food, I don't know. I mean, not chewing food, but it's like a piece of candy. Yeah, I feel and like when we were young, like, okay. a piece chewing of gum. kind of wild. Like chewed food and he's putting it in somebody's mouth, it's kind of wild. How about piece toothbrush? Of candy, I still, no, no, that's that's cleaning. That's like eating a girl p- pussy wearing she on period. You know what I'm saying? My ex used to use my toothbrush, and I thought it was the nastiest you can't fucking do that, shit. Fam. Certain things you don't do. Yeah, girls are not supposed to sw- you switch. You use my toothbrush the cha- the like tampons. a few times. Yeah, y'all don't switch tampons, right? What? No, we wear the same one forever. You know, I'm just, no, I'm just saying, y'all don't, y'all don't, y'all don't never. You know, how certain girls like girls like let, let me get that, and they're like, I right, hope I just put it in. Yeah, let me take the tampon out of my pussy and put give it to you <laughs> to put in yours because that's why a whole box of them comes so we can share I, one you know, pussy you know, tampon. I always wanted to sell them shit that one time. Yes. You thought, now you want to sell tampons? No, I thought all girls had the period at the first of the month, so I hate I, that. I used I promise you I was like I'm about to buy a bunch of fucking tampons and I'm gonna like sell Lucy's and I was gonna go to girls like yo you in your period. I don't understand why they don't sell Lucy uh, tampons everywhere. A win. That's a win. They sell it in the bathroom, but like only certain bathrooms. But that's what I'm saying. How much you think I get How the one? fuck do you know, twerk god? You know, I, I, I like the club. They got the condiments guy. Yeah, really okay. About, he was like, word. What's up, fam? <laughs> nah, nah, because that one time, you know, somebody told me a gay guy, they got, gay guys can have the periods now. Damn, I wish we could play music in the middle of this shit. I just want to hear, I'm coming out. Do, 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 do. I'm coming. I got a girl. I'm coming out. You don't like your girl no God. more. Go twerk God. Uh, yo, you you know want what? the world to know. Miss, Miss Twerk God, we we'll, we'll apologize for because when this motherfucker take your man shop and we get some new clothes, you know who did it. When he come in here with a new fly <laughs> fit. <laughs> you know what? He probably going to wear them shits here. He Jason probably going to know. <laughs> you know, gonna have Jason G- Lee gear. <laughs> <laughs> Jason <laughs> Lee TV. <laughs> Yo. Yo, that's that's a good that's a good thing to do though. Okay. So we're gonna get straight into some calls. Yeah. Who's on it. drugs and all that good man. stuff. So um y'all gotta i I'm, I'm, lo- I'm losing faith in some of these callers. It was kinda crazy, yeah. Because, you know, y'all been a little weird. Just a little bit. So we need y'all to come back so that I could make this my favorite segment again. Because right now it's the voicemails. Yeah? Okay, so Wax, what's the motherfucking number? The motherfucking number is 347-679-6118. Holla at us. Call up here. That's right. Call up and all that good stuff. I like that shit. Do you have a fucking... (laughs) Would you swap with one of your friends? Would you swap with one of your friends? Hell no. I don't give I don't give a fuck if I know my meat bigger. You still ain't touching my shit. What if like his girlfriend is bad and you just like one time I'm gonna let you fuck not, her? Not, listen, if I got me a jump on, I got one like a like a girl that I'm not really my wifey. Oh dang, I've been that's my that's my that was my life. No, but like not even say it's your your boy that's like listen. I know you've been looking at my girl. Da da da. I'm gonna just let you fuck her one time because she said she that you sexy anyway. So fuck it. This nigga got. Would you do it? To my wife. And it's your friend. My... You, nigga, his bitch Wanna wants fuck to fuck me. you. Your man's bitch it happened wants before. to fuck you. It happened before and I said no. Multiple times I said no. Is there anybody you would say yes to? Um, No. I'm you don't have to say their name. Nope. Really if you sure. weren't in a relationship. If I wasn't in a relationship, was there somebody that... Um, if that billionaire guy said I would pay you to have sex with Rihanna no not pay this is just like listen my wife wants to get fucked by somebody else you my man I know you would never do no funny shit <laughs> no no I mean like <laughs> by, behind my back because Respect, yeah, okay. you know this is something that we talking about you telling me you doing it whatever right. I know you never gonna do no funny shit behind my back but just go ahead and fuck her one time and she's so. not married and if I wasn't in a relationship, yes, I'd probably bust her doors down. Even though that's your friend's bitch, that, that's not really his bitch. He's not going to keep her too long. She, she's, she's just, a, he's about to get rid of her. 
Any one of my guys, we should have around the same morals. We don't want somebody tamper with our wife. Mm, I don't know if that's true because this nigga here with the story. He's he's he wild. Was, he's not ready to get rid of her. He feels now like he now. Is. No, no, no. Now he feels like he's not enough for her. He's not. But he <laughs> But he don't feel like, oh, I don't want her no more, so I'm letting her fuck another nigga. This situation happened because it's like, all right, ten years. Let's, let's figure out. Something. Yeah, let's do something. And he uh, fucked skydiving, up. dumbass. Right, anything. That's a better. That's a bigger meat than a fucking meat. You know what I'm saying? No. All right. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's see what these calls are sitting for. Let's do it. Who's on drugs? Who's on drugs? Who's on drugs? Who, 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 who. It's on drugs. What's your name? How you doing? My name is Princess. How you doing, Princess? How you doing, princess? How you hey, doing princess. Yes, ma'am. How you doing? Hey, L'Oreal. <laughs> hey, boo. Okay, no. Now you trying to fuck L'Oreal nasty. Okay, go ahead. Listen. Listen. Okay. My dick so ain't what hurt. Was, <laughs> but you know, anyway, no. Ooh. I was not expecting it to. <laughs> no, I was not expecting it to be curved. So when I met this guy, I randomly just picked him up on at a club. Like, you know, good old 2020 fashion. Nasty. And I'm doing, like, he offered me a ride home. And usually I was like, nah. But then I looked at the Uber price and it was $81. Oh, you so like, which like, way are we going? <laughs> <laughs> exactly. I was like, listen, just drop me off a little close. You know, give him two blocks down from your real house. Please. So that, right. you know, he don't know where you live. Uh-huh. So anyway, but he was looking really good. He was smelling good. I was feeling drunk. So I was just like, fuck it, you should come to my house. Ooh. So I invited him in. And you can already see, like, his print. So you know that he's, like, one of those guys that was a shower. So I'm like, wow. all right, like, this is going to be a good night. This is going to be a good night or whatever. Uh, fast forward, we start kissing and talking, like, you know, getting into the motions of things. And I'm realizing that he keeps growing. Like, when he was soft, he was already a good seven inches. But he kept growing. Mm-hmm. And I'm just like, dude, like. Whatever, I was drunk, so I'm like, I can handle it. You know, I'm a bad bitch. You know, you got to give yourself that, like, inner talk. Like, right. I can handle this big Motivation. Dick. Mm-hmm. In the mirror, like Issa. But anyway, <laughs> um, but then I started, like, trying to take it from the back. And that's when it hit Whoa. me. It, it hit that's me. The, no, that's the like, worst. That's when you it, get it all. Was it wrong? Oh, my God. Ma'am, it, like, what's your it, name again? It went in places that, like... I'm like, I'm pretty sure it hit, like, my fucking stomach, like, my Listen, cervix, like, Non-angel. Everything. Non-angel. That's your name. Was oh, it wrong? Yeah. You was drinking. Was, was it, it wrong? wrong? Yes. No comment. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I can't T-Diddy tell you. Face. No comment. T. Diddy face. Uh, She's laughing. Uh, <laughs> so you took a man no, home. No, no, no. This is what I'm getting, non-angel. You gonna sit there and take a man home from the club and let him smash raw because he smelled good. Listen, here's the thing. You know sometimes you just when you said that stuff, about the pastor's wife. You said they smell ladies, good. Though. Old ladies don't have nothing. Wax just Listen, said he did the same is, thing. Know, but you can't judge me for doing me. Guys do it all the time. They go and you're not a guy. And and neither are so? you, Wax. Shut the fuck up. You're oh, a bitch. Oh, thank you, Mario. Put him in his place. He's wilding out. Shut up, Miss Lady. But no, One the craziest thing about... What was that? One penis Don't a year, Don't listen please. to him. One penis a year. Yeah, that's what you tell yourself? Yes, man. That's how much he can have. Yeah. <laughs> no, but what was so crazy is, like, with him, like, it was, it was, it was actually really good. Like, it wasn't painful. Too painful. Like, it hit. But what was crazy is the next day. So, like, I'm going to just be forward. Like, I get really wet. So, like, it goes in and and, and out, like, pretty easy. Like, I can handle big dick. Like, that's not a problem. Okay. What I've never experienced is second day pain inside my pussy. Like, it wasn't my wall. It wasn't my wall that was hurting. Like, deep inside was hurting. And I'm just like, how? So now he's like texting me, like wanting to hang out, and I'm dodging him, and not because he was a, he wasn't a good guy, but just because like he gave me three or four day like pussy pain, and I just was not trying to have all of that. So I was just like, I had so to let him go. And I finally, <laughs> hmm? what did the doctor what the say? Doctor say 
Listen, you can't go to the doctor and be like, excuse me, my pussy hurt. He trying and, to like, say that the nigga burned you. Raw penis? No. Is that the only girl no, who No, that's this not show? what it was. See, I understand that, you know, you probably haven't gotten dick in a while, so you kind of forgot how it might feel like. Ooh. But when you have sex. Right. I never had it before. <laughs> Never had it before. Yes, you well, did, you, you lying sex. fuck. Yeah. You know he's, mm, wax, I see you on, you know. Where? Your Let pictures, you looking a little Where? questionable. Oh! I got the same oh, pose. I'm a, you I'm, look I'm, spicy. I'm, 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 everywhere. I got the same pose for everywhere. Tell me what picture. She said so you we look go to fuego. It. You look I only got, I only got that, Instagram pictures. That, that, say less, say less. Give me like 24 it. hours. I no, got you. I want, listen, I, 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 I asked so many people to make this shit happen. Please. She said, "Cause you, your you shirts nothing. be tight all the time. Nah, you be trying to show your titties." Shut up. You, you know what's crazy? You think no, you're I'm gonna give you twenty four. Don't fucking say. Let me hear it. No, no, I'm gonna angel. give you twenty four hours because I want you to be questioning your own self. I need you to look at your own Instagram. Like, damn. <laughs> nope. He gay. I know what's about. on there. I know what's on there. It's only <laughs> videos, and I keep my head down. I wear the same clothes. I don't wear thong sandals. I'm not putting nothing wow. in my ass. I don't ask girls to look at my ass. I don't put no fingers in my ass. I'm not smashing a guy. I never gave head. I never fucked a guy. Shut up, non angel. You let a man smash, or you fucking day <laughs> off. Shut up, cause you got on a crop top hoodie. <laughs> Fucking when I'm at the work, look at me on my day off. What are you doing on, a, on your day off? You're supposed to do whatever the fuck you want. I feel like you're judging me like this not He is, and he's a, no, a cornball. No, I'm not. No, I'm yeah, not. he's trying to. No, I'm not. Can I tell you this one thing? I I'm love all. I'm intimidated by my power. He it's got right. French braids. No, real, quick, real fast. <laughs> I, I, listen, real fast, real fast. I bet you would tell a young girl not to do that. Am I right? What? To f- not to, be to have free sex? Do what she well, wants to do. That's not free. She didn't have. Listen, she's a grown ass woman. woman. She didn't have. She had raw Thank sex. Thank you. Like she was My thing is, I would rather you not fuck an ex before you Never. fuck a stranger. Like. Never. No, Wax, you're the most disgusting person I ever Where met in my I fucking life. I smashed a girl at, at, at from a club with raw. You bugging? You smash mad bitches raw. Listen. You th- you got a child. You're not even sure it's your we child. Understand. Listen, maybe. Maybe. No, okay, he did say he had a child out there. We understand that. Not just I never said I have not smashed, but I knew these girls. I never smashed somebody, and I'm lying. But for girls, <laughs> listen, listen. Okay, Tourette's. Shut up, Tourette's. <laughs> no, you right. I have. But I was a hoe. You were ridiculous. I was a fucking hoe. I will say this. You saying it was like it's not like you wasn't doing it last week. I will say no, I this though. That These no, niggas ma'am. are disgusting. Yes, so we let's are. try to protect I ourselves Please, ma'am. as much That's as possible saying. so we don't get sick Please. because they carry all kind of nasty diseases. That is very, very true. But and I think if it wasn't for the Henny, I it, probably would have made the right decision. Right. And you. we all make mistakes, but you're, what we're not going to do here on the Bully and the Beast podcast what? is judge. I'm not judging her. That's said, not what we're going to do. I'm, I'm going to tell you the right you, thing to do. I'm not judging her. When you talk her. about you love dick and everything, don't nobody fucking judge you. You're on drugs today. <laughs> Listen, listen. Shut I don't up. even feel a type of way because I know no, what I'm my not judging you. I, just want, I, I know you will tell a young girl. I know you will tell her some, another one of your friends like, Next time, put a comment. He on. mad because he never had a curved dick. I <laughs> think is it's all situational. Sometimes stuff happens. Yes, and I, we have I just to want you to be safe, safe next time. I said, like, yeah, I'm, like you're right, and I definitely Thank agree. You. That's like, all I'm asking. Obviously, the way to go, like in your right mind, obviously. Thank and you. Wax will take his own advice as well because yes, he is he yes, fucking ma'am. doesn't listen to himself. Uh, yo, listen. How much you got to cost? To pay to play I, devil's I, I, advocate, do you eat pussy with the dental dam every single time? What's, what's dental no, dam? he doesn't even know what that is. What's he that? doesn't know how much condoms cost. So you come out here what's fucking that? only really fucking no, no, raw. No, 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 I don't do that no more. I'm he so has gonorrhea sober. in his throat. Shut up. <laughs> It probably traveled to his hairline. I understand. <laughs> I understand. That, that fucked up. I know. That's like, Wait, I did. That might be a sensitive topic for you. No, I, I got bossed about everything. You should have seen it. You might as well just shave it all off, cool. I know it's fucked up, like Stevie. Go ahead. We could call you Joe Number Two. <laughs> you said go on what? Let me, let me get the joke. Call number wait. two. Like all of, you could be the leader of the, of the ball head niggas. <laughs> Dorian, that ain't even funny. Come on, come <laughs> give me something else, yo. Give me something. I'm going to give you one more chance. Come on, non, non funny. Come on, one more time. <laughs> what? One more time. I'm going to give you one more one time. One more time from what? Oh, a what better joke than that. A better joke than that. Just call him Whoopi. 
Real fast. Whoopi, say Whoopi. Whoopi, say it. I don't even got to call him Whoopi because, you know, when he looks in the mirror, he hurt himself every day. Yeah, you go, baby. Yeah. I knew you had something better. <laughs> I know you had something better, girl. I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it to you. I'm not going to do it to you. I got, I got, you, I got L'Oreal across from me. Spot. You think you can say anything to me? <laughs> I got L'Oreal across from me. He thinks that I say the worst stuff to Nobody him. Nobody else is saying nothing worse. He cries at night. Thank you. But, um, okay. T, I Di- T-, T- Diddy is Yo, trying to hang up on you. And, you and she, yeah, she's yeah, she not, <laughs> she not a good friend. She's not a good friend. Princess, you know you talk to uh, That's what you get, bitch. <laughs> yeah. That's what you get, T. Diddy. Oh, no. <laughs> T. Diddy. T. Diddy tried to say something and her mic Pop was her. off. It's okay. Pop this up in it's the okay. mouth. Okay. Take that. Take that. <laughs> and smack this up in the face with the mic. <laughs> All right, listen. I, I'm, I'm sorry, bitch. Thank you for having me. Is she from Philly? No, she's from New York. No, I'm from Brooklyn. Oh, we, can't Brooklyn. Hear, we can't hear you, T. Diddy. Listen, I do, I do like you. <laughs> I just want you to be safe. I want all y'all young ladies out here to be safe. That's it. I promise I wasn't judging you. I know we all make mistakes. No, no, no. I made I'm, I, I yeah. And, and you're right. Safe sex is the Thank best you. sex. That's so all that is. Yeah. Wax has Thank shit you, stains in his drawers. He can't sometime. talk about you know anybody. I have, I have unprotected sex plenty of times with people that I never even knew their fucking name. So I'm just wanting you to be out there. It happened to me. You know what I'm saying? I just want her to be safe. I'm not judging you at all. Stop it. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Prince. I know. Thank but you. definitely promote that gentle damn, you know, situation. Yeah, what, what, what right? is that actually, what is that? What you got to do with that? <laughs> you, it's like, like, Google it. No, like you just put something over the, the vagina before you eat it. It protects your mouth when you're eating that pussy. It's just like a cover. Have you ever sucked dick with a condom on? Yeah. Slut! Get off the phone. <laughs> Don't get, 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 get off the Are phone. Are you fucking serious? Get off the phone. Oh, oh, that's disgusting. Like, I'm playing, I'm playing, I'm playing. Yo, we gotta have Listen, to kill you this got, nigga Listen, wax. If you gotta put a condom on a given man head, you should not be sucking that dick. All right? I feel like if you don't suck dick for the first time with a condom on, you a super hoe. No, 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 no. <laughs> you should not be sucking Damn, that dick. Damn, I don't know. I don't feel the same. <laughs> Let me help you. No, 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 no. I'm not gonna lie. I must Thank be you. a super hoe because I never sucked dick with a condom on before. <laughs> super hoe. Oh. All right. <laughs> baby. I, 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 Brooklyn talk a lot. Peace. <laughs> Super ho. <laughs> She's wild. No, nah, no, for real. <laughs> and I feel like we talked about this before, but now that we talk about it, sex, I mean sex, um, head with a condom on. Come on, that's a prostitute, bro. Have you had t Diddy? t Diddy, I feel like I asked you this before, but just, what? you ever gave head with a condom on? Did I ever give head with a condom yeah. on? No. That's your prostitute. I was super ho. <laughs> <laughs> That's what she said, right? Yo. Brooklyn talk and a lot. And you never ate pussy with a dental dam. Never did, man. And you never sucked dick with a cod. <laughs> <laughs> Until. <laughs> shopping, shopping. Until. Look, look, instead of take that, take that, it's going to be shopping, shopping. Let me stop, because you know what? I don't Niggas want nobody to right. me like that. Yeah, yeah, okay. We did. That, that, yeah, yeah, that was the last one, Twerk God. I got you, man. That was the last one. But Twerk God's your name. Have you ever, <laughs> have you ever sucked? Pussy. What is with actually, a dental dam? What is actually dental dam? Nah. It's like dentist. It's like the it's like uh paper. Uh, what do you call it? What you call it? Saran wrap. It's like saran wrap. If I gotta eat, if I gotta eat pussy with saran wrap, I shouldn't be down to eating that pussy. That that's just like a girl with a condom. Like yeah, but that pussy. sound crazy because what if you like? That's like saying if you gotta wear a condom to fuck a bitch, you shouldn't be fucking her. No, no, no. You got to have the condom just to do that because that's just like a rule for guys. It's like pussy holds a whole lot of fucking germs and a lot of shit because they be having sex more than one penis a year. And you don't know who's having more than one penis a so year. So who's really holding the germs? The girl inside the inside the hole. No, the the guy. The guy ain't got no hole. He's the carrier. Exactly. Huh? Who got it? I got it from somewhere. What? Where like so? Uh, a is, man. Is this, is this, it's more like, men than it. I mean, it's more women than it is. So, men. so is this like what came first, the um, the egg or the chicken? Who got it first, the fucking girl or the guy? The guy. No way. The guy is the one that passes it to everybody. No, it's inside the hole. You put your meat in the hole and get something. It goes in the hole from the guy. That pussy was marinating and got inside somebody's sheets or something. Or yeah, you know, you know what? No. I heard. No, no, you know what? A girl lied to my boy, right? She said she sat on the toilet and got gonorrhea. She is fucking, bro. 
She is fucking. She's talking about. She I could at least taller. use that for like crabs. No, but but no, but the, she said that the, my boy said the doctor did say it's possible. You can't get gonorrhea from a toilet Sitting seat. Sitting down on a t- the toilet Maybe seat. herpes or crabs. <laughs> oh, good job. That's not no, good. because I feel like you have to go inside for like chlamydia and gonorrhea. It has to be like. I don't think it's like maybe uh, I'm saying it wrong. Maybe, maybe, maybe it was thing. something that you could sit on the toilet. It's herpes and crabs that people run with. That I'd be stuff. mad as a motherfucker sitting on the toilet. That's why I don't like sitting on public toilets, man. I mean, you do got to think about it. Like you got to be careful because if somebody does have any kind of sore or something like that, it's contagious. You could give your own self another sore because it's contagious. So say you have, you ain't never see somebody that like has a cold sore and then they'll like get something else next to the cold sore. It's because they fucking tried to pop their shit or some weird shit and it spread. That's some wild shit, yeah. It's contagious. <laughs> Look, Blissex ain't gonna fix that. You need some fucking yeah. dental dam. <laughs> How yeah. do it look? Google it, motherfucker. What's wrong with you? I don't know how to Google. Who Googles? Talk to Siri. Do your Googles. Talk to the girl. Do your Googles. Yo, who's on drugs? Hello? Hello? Hi. Yo, you stupid. Who's on drugs? Am I on? Yeah, Yeah. you on. What's up? Oh, hi. Hey. What's the topic? What's your name? Where you from? You got a nice voice. Mm, I don't want to say my name because my boyfriend watches you guys. Mm. I put him on and he's going to know. Okay. All right, Miss Anonymous. I think he's going to know because Where, where you from? Where you from? From California. Dope. Cali. Hey, bro, your girl from Cali, her name is April. All right, go ahead. Shut up. <laughs> so what's going on? What, Talk uh, to us. You, you got some advice you need or you just want to weigh in on the topic? Yeah, what's the topic? Uh, what, 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 would you let your boyfriend? Uh, no, if you would you smash another guy raw if you having a threesome with your boyfriend? No, that's not the topic. That sound like that's out of my brain. Yeah, sound like you just said back the story. Would would you would you and your boyfriend go to like a swinger club or something? Oh my god, would you swap out your boyfriend for one no. of your friends? Like basically, if your friend came to you and was like, "Listen, let's." Just fuck each other's boyfriends for the night and act like none of this ever happened. Would you do that with any one of your friends? Drunk. Fuck no. I am too psycho for that. Yeah. That's how I feel. Like, I'm not trying to let my fucking dick I go can't. all around Yeah, and I, ain't let, and I ain't let my girl, not my wifey, I'm not doing that. No, shit. but you said you would fuck your friend's uh, girlfriend. I have, but th- I think he was done with her already. Once you find out that your girl want to fuck one of your friends anyway, you like, uh, she's already out the door. Did you ever fuck one of your friends' boyfriends? Like, no. before? Like, y'all were together and then maybe they got with them? No, never. Okay, well, this yeah, what's topic the, what's is the, for you. Yeah, what's the closest bad shit you ever did, Angel? Have you ever done a threesome? No. Okay. I've been curious, but no. Okay, okay. Uh, okay, curious. curious. All right, okay. so, all right, here Whoa. we go. You giving us yeah, something. Give me something, all baby. Right. So who would you pick to have a threesome with with you and your boyfriend? Which one of his friends? No, it could be a girl or a guy. A girl? I don't think it would be a boy. It would have to be a girl. Okay. And I now, think. who would the girl be, though? What are your friends? Shut Which up. Let her answer. No, not, I don't think anyone I know. It has to be a stranger. Do you have someone in mind, though, that you feel like, uh, I don't, but if I did, you see no Instagram this bitch could get it? Um, no. I think if we were to go out and just someone random. Really? Yeah. What if he took the condom off in the middle of the three? Oh, no. Uh, they're both dead. Ooh. They're both going to die. Ooh, she's psycho. I will play what if she eat your pussy better than he does? Good job, L'Oreal. Oh. I do this for a living. You could girl. do that, but. You're nasty, too. Mm. Like, would you sneak yeah, around with her? That, but. <laughs> uh, <laughs> depends on how good. Ah. <laughs> Whoa. So, so why, why don't you tell your boyfriend to try to get lessons from this girl? Like, baby, look what she's doing. Look how she do it. I want it done like this. She never said he couldn't do it. I just said if he if she does if it If she better. do it better, she got to teach her man. Because, like, if you want to stay with your man, you're not going to just run away from some pussy. Like, two, I, don't, I don't understand with two girls. Y'all can, y'all can lick each other and what? Hunt pussies? That shit ain't going to See, lie. but a threesome, it's like a fantasy. Mm-hmm. But then me 
thinking that he's probably gonna like try to go get it again go behind my back yeah, that, yeah. yeah that's gonna like that's most fuck with think. my mind I mean well that's what most niggas mm-hmm. do and, they, then, yeah. and not only that I feel like once you open Pandora's box it's like now you gotta have a threesome every right. other week and shit <laughs> <laughs> like, fuck. Right. you come home but baby I got dessert like no the girl come out the closet uh uh-uh. uh <laughs> with apron I, my I stomach the food. hurt today I wasn't trying to be doing all this well, shit sit here and watch us then <laughs> <laughs> nah, that's fucked up. She cooked the food, yo. We gotta come on, hold it down. You, you got a side, nigga? No. Oh, you can't oh answer that. He listen. I don't. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Good job. Girl. <laughs> no, I don't. Good job. Which one of the guys at work? I, you, Lisa. Listen, you got a work husband, at least. No, I don't. Mm-hmm. Oh, she's an angel. <laughs> Have you ever cheated on anybody? Anybody? Shit. Uh, yeah, my ex. Oh my gosh! I can't believe you did this <laughs> with a girl or a guy. I don't think you ever got a guy, but it's not really. I don't count it because my ex was a rebound, so he should have uh, known. Okay. Okay. How long y'all been together? How long you stay with a rebound? We were only together for like five months. Doesn't count. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, he, yeah. Respect, he was meant to get you. Yeah, yeah. I was just smashing anyway. He was practice. Yeah, that's all it was. Yeah. But girls are supposed to have practice, though. Shut up, Wax. All right. Yeah. Okay, well, I'm going to have to let you guys go. I got to go. No, don't be going to let you go. You guys. I love the podcast. Say, <laughs> like, now we playing with you, baby. We appreciate this. Love the podcast. Thank appreciate you. It. All right. We scared her once we said that he's going to know her voice. Yeah. She's like, fuck this yeah, question. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <She> <laughs> I got to live lightly. somewhere next yeah, week. She tried it lightly. And it's here. Yeah, yeah no, hell no. She know that nigga paying them rent and them bills. She hell like, fuck yeah. this question, yo. She tried it lightly. Yeah, yeah. Like yeah. She's like, I'll email it. What you the they say the email was? No. Let her know the email. Yo, What's the email? The bully and the motherfucking beast at gmail.com, right? Yeah, let's, this is for all y'all scary motherfuckers that <laughs> y'all listen together and then you would have asked about She's them. No, no, no. Ass. Write a good story like this motherfucker so I can narrate listen, it. She said she didn't cheat on him, right? She said she cheated on her ex. No, he hate the ex. It was him, though. Yeah, it was him. She talked about him. She's like, as a matter of fact, I gotta go. I'm gonna let y'all go. I've Damn. already said too much. Like, nigga, he's like, wait a minute, we've been together five months. <laughs> he's a five month nigga. <laughs> Yo, oh, all right. Shit. I don't know. Y'all better call with some motherfucking tea. Come on, man. For and real. don't be scary, neither. I'm not Let's go. Is- Who's on drugs? <laughs> Niggas is crazy. Don't Who's call, with no, don't call with no shabby drugs? phone. Yo. Don't call with no shabby phone. Whatever that staticky noise is. He's driving. He's driving. Oh, oh, roll the window up, nigga. Yeah, I'm driving. I'm, I'm, I'm leaving school. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to get my shit right. You know what I'm saying? All right. I sound like you're on the microphone. Wait, wait, where you from? In front of your cell phone. Where you from? Where you, what's your name? I'm from San Antonio. Uh-uh, the sound got to be right. He got to pick it up. Can you put your phone to your ear? Now you're driving. You might yeah. got Yeah, yeah, we good. We good now. Yeah, we good there now. Go. Oh, there hey. Go. San Antonio in the house. Yeah. Yeah. San Antonio 210. We out here. We out here. Oh, I'm right. I'm right. What's going on with you? All right, so check it out. So I'm, I'm supposed to get married in like 22 days, right? Mm-hmm. Oh, shit. Let and... me sit back for this. I like this. <laughs> <laughs> so look, I'm supposed to get married in like 22 days, whatever, whatever. So, you know what I'm saying? I got an ex who's really like my best no. friend. Like, she got a dude. She got a dude and everything. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, we talk about all kind of shit. Like, help each other out in each other relationship type shit. So, uh, she 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 had, she had hit me the other day and was like, you know, what's going on with you? And my pockets was a little fucked up. And I was like, man, I'm just a little hungry or whatever, whatever. So, she cashed at me $5 or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Just something quick. Okay. Grab a hot bite to eat. Which so McDonald's. My um, I I, I I leave my phone. I leave my phone in the room or whatever. You know what I'm saying? To go go do some shit in the other room. And my lady go through my phone, and she like, well, why she sending you money and and da 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 and, yes. and what you did for to get to her to give you five dollars? I'm like, I oh couldn't have been. I, I couldn't have been doing much for no five dollars. <laughs> <laughs> It's my you dollars. You me? Like, yeah, I ain't doing right. much of shit. What, I wiggled the big toes? Hey, man. Explain to me what a nigga did for $5. <laughs> That's funny. So, a smile. So, so, so she, she, you know what I'm saying? So we get into it, whatever, whatever. She take off the ring, all kind of shit. Damn. 
So you need to get her out your life. Um, you know what I'm saying? And, and all this, I'm like, damn, I was five dollars. Like, yes, what's happy up? wife, happy life, bro. You gotta take some L's with your with your shorty. You know what I'm saying? If you really love her, you're already, you're already at the stage where you say you can marry this woman. You gotta make her comfortable, and that's kind of fucked up. But you guys gotta do it because if you're not, she's always gonna be around. Every time you get around her, you're gonna get your fucking problem. You know, you do not have time for that headache. But wait, she don't know her. They don't know each other. Sound like, like they do. Like they, they, they know each other through. They know each other through me. Like they know. Like my my fiance knows that she has been in my life since like before college and shit. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Like she she's known that shit already, but they've never actually met each other. Oh, and you're like, oh, but me? then that's your fault. That's really your fault. That's bro. your fault. You because should've, they, they should be cool friends. by yeah, now. They should have been best friends, bro. Unless you got a, a ulterior motive, like you would really want to fuck her. That's the only reason Just why one day. I could see you not introducing them. Because why? If y'all cool. Well, she... I mean, I ain't going to front. I ain't going to front when we, when, we, when we broke yeah. up and shit. Me and, me, and, me and my shorty, me and my shorty was, was like now, you know what I'm saying? Like I was, I was still like, I was, I ain't going to I was still like in love with shorty. You know what I'm saying? I left her. The only reason I left the chick that's my ex was because she was too scary to leave her people house. Like I'm like, man, I like I got a good ass job. I work the contract. See, you you left you know that saying? part out, you piece of shit. Like, I got... <laughs> you left that piece what? out. You Bro. left that part out. You ain't never say that you was fucking with her before. And, or that was your ex. You said this is your friend. Well, well, now she yeah, now she my friend, but I will Nigga, I mean, I'm about to smack yeah, this mic off of this table. Bro, you grind me as You hell. lucky your girl don't shoot the shit out and of you. And knock your girl. fucking head off in hers. Yo, yo, I'm, yo, I'm scared to talk like that to you right now. <laughs> yo, bro. <laughs> this is the wax. <laughs> this is what I'm talking about. Yo, bro, are you serious? This is the wax I need. Yo, bro, you got balls. I used to be you know like what? that. You don't really love that girl that you about to marry, so that shit is not going to work. Take the ring, let her keep the ring off. Yeah, because you obviously you still got shit. something with this other girl. Yeah, bro, you love the other girl. More. I mean, nah, me and her didn't talk like like we when I meet me and the other chick like we didn't, we were to the point you. where we know like this shit ain't gonna work out. Yeah, like we good. know that me and her, me and her really, me and her really supposed to just be friends because she she's. You she, still she got no her in the, the background. You still got her in the back seat. Waiting She's still the there. Up. Yeah. You waiting for her to want you back and your shit to fuck up. Exactly. You what what, what you doing now? Your dick would be in her mouth tomorrow if she said. Yes. And right now your other girl ring is already off, so you already thinking going towards her way already. She probably sent you ten dollars today. Yep. Now you now you you're feeling for <laughs> <laughs> did y'all did y'all eat? Matter of fact, they ate together. They ate together. They ate together. <laughs> they ate together. The you four for nasty four. Mother- nah, nah, hell. Ah, man, yeah. You gotta be smarter than that. If I ain't learn, if I ain't never learned shit from whack, is is never get caught outside with the bitch. Nope. You never do that. The Go fact inside. that you learn Why shit you from wax is even scary. No, always ready. So, <laughs> listen, when I used to cheat, I used to give great advice about cheating shit. Now I'm all about being faithful, bro. Do leave that girl alone unless you really gonna sit there and marry her. For real, because you're going to fuck her up. You don't get to a stage right. where you're going to be engaged with her and still Nigga. have an ex in the background. You are wild. He's about to be a runaway Dude. bride. It's only oh. 22 days. Yo, like, bro. That shit's next week. He's out. He didn't, <laughs> he didn't even invite us, so I know it ain't real. It ain't real. <laughs> How the fuck you don't invite boys? Wait, oh, hell no, she ain't getting invited. Fuck no. Wait, so she's not invited to your wedding? Hell nah. But y'all best friends. Nah. You a friend. Well, I, I only you, say you friend. But look, but look, I say I say hell no, nah, she not invited it only because I know I I know I know my fiance. You know what I'm saying? And I know Steady as fuck. Yo, bro, if you can't invite her, you never can't, you met can't her, be in your life. I already know what time it's gonna be. You, you can't, she can't be in your life. Period. She, you, if you can't invite her to your wedding, she can't be in your life. At all. Yeah, bro. Like, if you really love I your shorty, I, I if you really love her, hold her down for real. And that's yours. You don't want yours being fucked up and, and feeling certain shit. He lied to us, so you know he yeah, lying I, to her. He lied to her big Why time, he lie to bro. us? Why, I feel crazy. <laughs> Why he do that to now, us? Now you're making me think you did, did something for that $5, nigga. You listen, he <laughs> went with them toes. He told us what he did. <laughs> yeah. 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 Yo, yeah. this nigga was like, yo, we've been, 10 years ago, we was friends, like, since middle school and da-da-da. And I'm really thinking like, oh, she fronting yeah, us. Yeah, she, yeah, yo, bro, she you're acting crazy. Wilding. She wild. She wild. And all this was that. Now then he like, oh, I just ate that bitch pussy last week, but I forgot to tell her. I forgot she, she's my ex. <laughs> Actually, I left that five dollars at her house. That was my change. <laughs> I sent her to the store. Like, nigga, you got us, and you got her too. You nasty nigga who eats veggies, veggies, 
<laughs> what? Why he got to eat what? What the fuck? 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 I'm just saying because when your girl want to take you, you back. Get. When your girl take you back, that's what they do. They oh, put a bunch of virgin seal on there and make you eat their pussy. That's what the fuck they do? I'm trying to tell you. Don't listen to him. You better watch that shit. I, I heard about this dental dam stuff with, with virgin seal. Don't listen to it. That's not what a dental Yo, dam no, is. Yo, yo, Wax, how the fuck you never heard of dental dam? Thank niggas? you. I never heard of that shit. Nobody made, they made, used to make me do that. And listen, I was prostituting too. Yo, you so wild. You a wild nigga. You, you said I was. Yo, you a wild nigga. I wasn't, listen, these old ladies don't have nothing wrong with them. They live that long. Duh. You out here fucking eating Man, a young girl's pussy. Shit, they don't even know if they fucking gonna stay alive for a long years, time. Nigga, hell no. What are you talking about? Man. I'm sorry, we're gonna have to go because I don't know what the fuck is wrong with All this right, nigga. Yeah, I, 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 guess, I guess I'm on drugs. I guess that's the moral of the story. Yeah, I'm you on are. drugs, I nigga, with your lying your, ass. You, yo, bro, you the on drugs fu- for real. Wait, what are you gonna do, though? No, nah, I mean, I'm I'm gonna let her go, man. She she don't have she don't have to move around, man. I I, I love my shorty, man. We gotta. We oh, thank yeah. God, I was scared. I was scared, man. Damn, I'm a five dollars. <laughs> 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 this nigga really like money. Yeah, that's five dollars. That nigga really hungry. <laughs> he hungry hold enough. on, hold on, hold on. Do, do your wife feed you? <laughs> she don't cook. Yeah, no, nah, I mean we. She good, like I said, my pockets was just a little fucked up. I just paid bills and car notes. Yeah, all that wife, he's supposed to feed you though. That, that's what's supposed to, that's a partnership. We didn't have no what, what, money to bring no food in the crib. Oh, in the crib. So, yeah. oh, you and your wife, he both ate off that file. So, tell her to shut up. Cup of noodles. Dollar menu. Doritos. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Cakes and shit. <laughs> two four orders. for four, I told you. Four for four, four, for four. Two You get the fries and the nuggets. You get the burger and the other shit that comes with the and four and four. And then, and then, man, hello, silly ass. Hello, silly ass don't even like Wendy's, man. Let me uh, get up off this phone, man. Uh, uh, down, that's man. why you like the other girl. She, she low like maintenance. Wendy's. She yeah, Because she, she knew like $5. Yeah. Like yeah. Because once he said he was hungry and she gave him $5, five you like, knew what kind of bitch he was dealing with. All the way down. You went to the chicken check with that shit. She <laughs> didn't get out like n- n- no enough dub. for delivery. <laughs> yeah, and like, that's $22 but, for a delivery. Yeah, you get what I'm saying? Nowadays, $40 one person shit. delivery. Shit. The fee's $18. No bullshit. All day. Right. All right, well, enjoy that for a $18 junior burger. Fuck you that. You get what I'm saying? All right, man. Go get wifey some food. Yeah. Real food. Matter of fact, have the other girl buy your wifey a fucking present. Tell her you hungry. Yes. Yes. All right, peace out. Please Please, don't call that bitch no more. Nope, he is. (laughs) He about to call her as soon as he get off the phone (laughs) with Right away, he hungry. She on the other line. That's why he was (laughs) rushing us off at the end. (laughs) This is my food for tonight. Yeah, Yeah. he like, bitch, I'm going to starve or talk to y'all motherfuckers. Food food is very important, though. Like, if you fucking around my food, like, act like you don't give me the pussy. The pussy's all right. I'll figure it out. I jerk off and all that type of shit. I can't cook for myself. So one thing you do not do is act like you do not want to feed me. Because even when I got in trouble with my mama... She still fed me. That's why you. That's why you got that unconditional love. Because when you know you did wrong or something. What if some there's school, no food in the house? Oh, I can't fuck with you anyway. He's the, well. He's supposed to be bringing the bread in. We'll figure out. I, I make sure it. the food. Yeah, you gotta cook it. Yeah, but ain't no food there. But well, he's a bum ass nigga. He just got five dollars. He got five dollars. It was happy. And had an <laughs> argument over that five dollars. <laughs> I don't know. I'll send this bitch back her fucking measly ass $5. I'm not about nah, to be arguing. No, 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 no. I got to feed my baby. So he's paid bills. He did all that. Did I, rent everybody paid. got spaghetti in the house. I ain't got shit. You don't got at least like spaghetti in the cabinet? If I show you my my uh, fucking fridge, it's a, it's a half cut avocado, uh, um, some Jamaican food. There you go. Uh, Microwave that no, bitch. No, it's been there for like two months. Yeah. Uh, it got the old grapes that I probably still didn't do. I got sea moss. Um, I got a bunch of wines, wines on the, the, down here. Your wine up. Why, no, it's my shorty. Like, and the rest of the stuff is just shit that she left. I don't look in the fridge. Damn, she don't. Uh, so she don't feed you. How you gonna tell another? No, man? no. Everything I, when she's there, she cooking stuff like that. So when she leaves, but she don't I'm leave you out. with no fucking spaghetti or nothing. I can't cook. I can't. I, don't I feel like spaghetti shit. always in the pantry. You could throw some sauce or some butter on that motherfucker. You hide throw some fucking Parmesan cheese and you. Nah, I'm not gonna cook. I'm sorry. I burn everything. It's either burnt or it tastes like salt. How you or gonna water. burn noodles? <laughs> I don't even think you could burn noodles. Shit. Yeah, you know wax. I'm just dry as a motherfucker. 
<laughs> I can't cook for shit. I don't know what it is. I think cooking is a skill. You know, I certain I, I could go to a piano and just like play. Certain people sound stupid. Well, you know what? I'm gonna send you some Hello Fresh, and then therefore That's, you'll learn how to cook. Thank you. You know, because it's very simple, and uh-huh. I definitely use it. Yeah, I did it one time, and I I told you I did it for a date, and I actually got I got to smash the girl that night too. Because of HelloFresh. She smashed the door in your face. All right, Bully and the Beast podcast? Yes, man. Thank y'all for listening. We like that. Make sure you continue to rate, review, subscribe, tell a friend to tell a friend. Check us out on YouTube, on SoundCloud, and every motherfucking thing. Get your motherfucking hoodie. Man, now, on, we man. told you before, I think we got new sizes because some of y'all motherfuckers was yes. bigger than we supply. <laughs> A lot of big niggas, man. Which I didn't understand because wax squeezed into one, so y'all could have figured it out. <laughs> Literally, though. <laughs> yeah, get you some <laughs> baby oil and blue chew because you need your arms to be moving. I'm going to tell you what it is. I'm going to tell you a trick. What's the trick? You definitely got to lube yourself. Just put a little extra lotion lube. on. Lube. Spermicidal lube. Got a little extra lotion. And then the Jergens lotion, just put a little bit on your elbows and your shoulders and you'll be high. But don't get the jerking because then that shit might rip on the arm. What's jerking? No, anyway. So go to our Instagram, Bully and the Beast Podcast, and you can order your motherfucking now, I usually post it almost every day and it definitely should be on my um, story and my um, the Wax King, W-A-X-K-Y-N-G. Go in there and flip up on my shit. Wax has the special crop top version for when he's at home. (laughs) (laughs) But we out, Bully and the Beast. Bless. You know I was going to get you, folks. (laughs) (laughs)